Hello again, friends. It's Kristen. For today's video, I went to Target and got their two like beauty advent calendars. One's the 12 days of beauty and one's the 12 days of wellness, which I think is supposed to be more like self-care, body care kind of stuff. Um, it looks like it has everything listed on the back, but I'm not going to look. I want to be surprised. These retail for $20 each, but today, Saturday, the 11th, um, they, there's a Target Circle. If you have the Target Red Card, they have certain promotions and deals. They're doing 25% off of, like, beauty gift sets or something. I don't remember the exact wordage, so I got them for $15 each. You can order them also online um, or get them in store. And so let's start with 12 Days of Wellness. This says it's valued over $60. And okay. Um, it did come shrink wrapped, but I took that off already. So day number one is up here. So if you do the math, at the sale price, it's like $1.25 a item. If you do the non-sale price at $20, it's $1.67. So, oh. <laughs> First up, we have Vital Proteins. This is a collagen peptides. It's just not something I'm into, these supplement things. I just, I probably should, but... I'm not. Maybe you know, it's vanilla. I don't know. My husband might like it. Or maybe I'll put it in an iced coffee or something. I don't know. All right. So number two is down here. They're all like fairly, they're not too like out of place, which is nice. It's so good with number one, I thought. Next up we have from Vici Mineral 89, a fortifying and plumbing daily booster. So I'm guessing this is kind of like a serum. A tiny, tiny serum. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've gotten this before um, somewhere. Just a little bit, like what, probably five mils, three mils. Wow. But a couple days of serum, take it on a trip or something. All right, number three, this little circle here. A little pot. I'm guessing Cetaphil or CeraVe. We might never find out. Get out of there. Oh, I was correct. Sarah V. Which I do enjoy their products there. Nice. This is healing ointment. So really like you can put it anywhere. It's probably a little bit thicker than just like a regular moisturizer. So if I'm feeling extra dry, like Knees, ankles. I feel like my ankles get really dry. A lot of people say like knees and elbows. I have dry ankles because I'm weird. But I've oh, I've enjoyed pretty much everything I've tried from CeraVe. We see them quite often in uh, like Walmart boxes and little Target things. And then we got number four right here. I think a mask. And down. Yes, so this is from Cubella. It is a mud mask, pore minimizing, T zone, and full facial. So, it's like that. I don't really have like huge pores, but I do have oily skin. So I am always on the lookout for a good mud mask to help like get those oils out. Number five.
didn't really it didn't really open up i just kind of like broke around it <laughs> the next stuff we have from the good patch is relax so i've gotten one of these i think it was a, a different type from the good patch it's supposed to be like help you decompress uh chill relax I don't know. I don't know if I believe all that. Um, but yeah. And these are actually pretty expensive, like even for just one. Kind of like ridiculously expensive in my opinion. That was five, right? Because I had to bust it. All right, number six is down here. Ooh, we have from Pacifica. This is a vegan collagen overnight recovery cream. That's a pretty good size too for a moisturizer. Or is it like a mask? Um, best use on clean skin. Apply before bed time. Do not rinse. Do a pack chest. So I guess he has like a moisturizer. I was kind of thinking maybe it could be like a over overnight mouse but that's a decent size 20 mils so all right seven down here looks like a little serum bottle oh no. it's a little bottle but it's not serum it is something i use quite often I actually have a decent backup but I will use it as a Dr. Teal's foaming at bath, soothes and sleep. I said this before, I don't know if it necessarily helps me sleep, but I do enjoy taking a bath with Dr. Teal's, whether it's like the bath salts or that or something like that. So that was seven. So we have eight over here it is falling apart. hoping this would be like a little shaving thing but it is uh the eos shea moisture hand cream and pomegranate raspberry which sounds delicious um does have a safety seal on it but i can still kind of smell it it smells nice i have used their hand creams before i don't think i have this scent so i'm happy to get that it will be used looks like number nine is peeking out right there they are nine, right? Yeah. This is from Welly. Oh, they made like band-aids and stuff. It's called Face Welly Face Savers. It looks like pimple patches. Yeah. I have a pimple over here that is so it's so weird. I have not got a pimple like that on my cheek and I don't know how long and it is so like red and angry it's gotten better but so this is a drug-free acne blemish, blemish patch and you can get four which is kind of stingy to I'm gonna be honest um but yeah I mean I'll use it I have kind of I don't have the best luck with pimple patches, I think, because when I get pimples, they never, they're always, like, under the surface. And so those pimple patches can't really get to them like they're supposed to. But I try them. Oh, wait. Was that? Oh. That was supposed to be nine, but there's something else in nine. Did it? Okay. Did it come from ten? No? Okay. I'm confused, because I thought that was nine, because it was peeking out. But... No, we have something else in nine. So I'm not sure where that came from. So I am excited for this. This is a beloved coconut and warm vanilla bath bomb. Yes. I can smell it. I usually, I don't care for coconut like alone, but with something, I usually like it. And I like vanilla. Yes. All right. What do we have next? Ten. I'm 
not sure what it is. Nice size thing. Oh, it's Mega Bag, Mega Babe <laughs> Bag. Uh, it's a fruit enzyme daily deodorant. So, I mean, that's still like a travel size deodorant, but still like big. Hmm. I feel like I've heard of Mega Bay, but I don't like remember what they've made or what I've seen from it. I just kind of remember the packaging. That's nice. Nice deodorant. All right, 11 is right there. And I'm just going to kind of like lift it up and try to tear it. We have a deep conditioning pack from Palmer's. So this is, I'm guessing, a hair mask. I feel like I've used this before. I don't remember what I thought, so it's probably just fine. So it was a Hask hair mask, so I love Hask hair masks. They're like, I feel like they've done the best for me. Anyway, but yeah, that'll be nice. I do like a hair mask. All right, number 12. So I'm guessing those pimple patches number 12 because number 12 is empty that is kind of would have been a bit of a letdown i if i'm going to be honest four pimple patches now if it was like even like 10 or 12 but four is a little a little stingy so but real quick we got the collagen pimple patches the Good Patch, Hair Mask, Facial Moisturizer, Hand Cream, this Bath Balm that I'm stoked about, a Mud Mask, a Deodorant, a little serum, and a little healing ointment that can be used you know, for lotion anywhere, and then the Foaming Bath. So that's not bad. I'm... I'm happy. I think I'm going to say I'm happy with that. So, all right. Could it have been a little bit better with like, you know, a few more pimple patches? Sure. And I, you know, I personally don't like the supplement thing, but that's a personal preference. But next up we have the 12 days of beauty. So this has over a $50 value. So, like before, since I paid 15 it's about $1.25 a door. If you were to pay regular price, it would be like $1.67. Going in with number one. And I didn't really sneak peek, but I did, like, accidentally see. Like, I knew, I knew in this one we were getting some, time, some type of Dr. Teal's. Um, in this one, I'm pretty sure we're getting an e.l.f. product. So first up, we have another EOS product. This is a lip butter and pink lemonade. That sounds wonderful. Come on, lights. There we go. I remember trying the EOS, like the little balls. It smells nice. Do you remember those? The little, I, they still have them, but they used to be like all the rage. Probably a very, very long time ago. <laughs> so number two. I don't want to see the faces I make when I'm trying to open these. I'm sure it's lovely. Ooh, from Winky Lux. Oh, we have a unibrow precision pencil. I tried this a long time ago and I didn't care for it, but I might give it another shot. The packaging is so cute, but it looks... Guys, come on. All right, uh, let's go at number three. Really? So this is Healthy Hair and Nails from Ollie. It's two whole gummies. Like, it's not going to do anything. Guys, no. No. Absolutely not. I'm least give like a week's worth like two gummies what, what are you doing all right <laughs> number four we got a sponge from sonia kajik 
I used to, I used to always get um, mixed up Sonia Kajic with like Sonia G and their brushes and I was like why is everybody making such a big deal about Sonia G brushes? You can get them at Target. <laughs> I don't have any Sonia G brushes. I've heard they're great, great, amazing, but they are very, very expensive. But so whenever I see it, I kind of laugh at myself. It's a blender and it's cute. I like it. Uh, five is right down below. Ooh, we got something from Bliss. This is a cream to water hydrator. So another moisturizer. Let's open it up and make sure that it like fills the box. It does. So that's a pretty good size. So I am happy with that. Two gummies. Tell me. <laughs> Number six is right here. And we got something from Bioma. So this is a depuff and brightening eye gel. I haven't tried anything from Bioma, but I've heard really good things. And it's fairly inexpensive. I mean, you can get it at Target. So, and once again, like appropriate packaging. And it's an eye gel, so. And let's see how many mils. I don't. Five mils. So usually an eye gel is like 15 or an eye cream. So this is about a third of a full size. So that's a pretty decent size. Get some good use out of that. Seven is down here. Ooh, we got some Bestis dry shampoo. I've used it before. I did enjoy it. So, woohoo! Number eight is right here. This is the liquid IV that we see a lot in. We used to get it all the time in Walmart beauty boxes. It's in tart green apple. I think my husband enjoyed them, so I'll see if he wants it. I think there's like sugar in it, so I don't. Yeah. 11 grams of carbs so 10 of sugar so I try to stay away from that because of problems I have <sighs> so another like supplement type thing all right number nine is down here this before or I have it and haven't gotten to it yet but I've heard decent things so 10 is right next to it and I'm just gonna just gonna do this number it's like yeah it's a Aussie three minute it's a deep conditioner It's weird that we got just the conditioner, not the, um, whatever it's called. Shampoo. Next up. All right. This is the one I was pretty sure I saw that we were going to get. It's Elf, the Power Grip Primer. Um, I have the nice of mine one and I remember using it and talking about it, like the new makeup I tried and I was like, the texture is just too weird, but I have gotten used to it and I do enjoy it. So I'm happy to get another one. And I will use it. All right, number 12. Maybe it's a palette. Maybe it's beautiful lipstick. I was hoping for more makeup. So we got like a primer and a setting spray and the unibrow um, eyebrow pencil. We really didn't get much makeup. I was hoping for more makeup. And no, we didn't get more makeup. We got tanning drops, which I do not enjoy myself, but I've seen this brand Tanologist around, so I think it's a decent brand, um, but it's not for me. So if you're into that, it's probably a good door. So 
got the tanning drops, we got the sponge, just the conditioner, dry shampoo, primer, setting spray, um, eye gel, a moisturizer, the little brow, lip, and the liquid IV. I will, these are kind of spendy though. They're like a dollar fifty each. So and I, my husband might like it, especially green apple. And this this is just is so just don't know. Do like anything else. Like and then like a mini lipstick, but two gummies, this is not gonna do anything. So although I mean I'm not happy like excited about every product. I think overall, especially since I got it on sale, I mean, this sponge is probably five to $10, even though I don't pay that much out of pocket, but I get, I know the minis for these are $5. Um, these two moisturizers, the lip. Yeah. So I'm, I'm okay um, with what I spent. I might not be as happy if I spent full price, but yeah, that's what I got. So, and it's fun. The mystery and the whole advent thing is fun. And there's a lot of good advent calendars out there, but also they're 200 plus, $300. So I, I figured dropping 15, I couldn't be too disappointed. So, all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like subscribe, comment down below, send your friends. We have a lot of fun here and I really, really appreciate you spending your time with me. Thank you so much. Bye.